Now on Just One Station, a man accused of being a laser pointer, and that has him on the wrong side of the law. Sentence Nicole and Salada, live in Fort Lauderdale. She has this exclusive. Nicole. Yeah, at first BSO, Velkies thought that they were dealing with someone who may have just been a reckless driver. Then they thought perhaps it was somebody who was maybe mimicking a police officer, trying to get people to think he was in a police cruiser. But then it turned out to be something even potentially more dangerous. The BSO chopper in the air Friday night, May 27th, after a report of reckless drivers apparently doing donuts in the middle of a busy street. Until this. Hey, just laser. A green laser. Police say 18 year old Alex Singleton was behind the wheel of that car, not only pointing the laser up at the pilot, but also using red and blue lights that mimic that of a police car. The FAA says laser pointers can incapacitate a pilot by causing glare or what's called flash blindedness when it's difficult to see after exposure to high intensity light. When it hits the hits the windshield, everything goes green. So that's the only thing we're seeing. Back in 2019, Sergeant Christopher Marques told 7 News it had happened to him about 10 times. It's dangerous. It's definitely not fun. It's not funny. It's not fun for us. You know, it's my life up there. It's my crew member's life and you know, potentially everyone on the ground below me. Aiming a laser pointer at a pilot is against federal law. Alex Singleton, taken into custody soon after he was spotted by the chopper, told police he did use the laser pointer in the direction of the helicopter, but he didn't mean to. And now he is facing three criminal charges, um, obstruction of police, also resisting, fleeing and eluding, and the use of that laser pointer. That also could bring a hefty fine, a civil fine from the FAA. Reporting live in Fort Lauderdale, Nicole Insalata, 7 News.